It's been a long-standing tradition for a bride to throw her bouquet to her guests at her wedding. But when Lauren stepped in and launched Seema's flowers across the room, it left their friendship looking far from rosy. want the fucking flowers. Throw those bastard flowers. Yeah, you've just smashed my bouquet. OK, well, I'm going to say sorry, but if you can't chase me all night trying to give me flowers, I don't want. I didn't want to give them you. Maureen, you don't need to throw them like that. Please, all you right, don't I'm need to. I'm going to go home, then, if that's how you feel. Well, if you, that's how you feel, see ya. I'm a grown woman. I don't need my wrist slapped for a bunch of flowers that I clearly said I didn't want. So upset. You don't do that, Dawn. Don't do what? I was throwing them to Lauren to catch her. Lauren threw them. I'm not talking about oh, you. Oh, no, I didn't do that. So let me tell you what happened. No, I'm not even bothered, Dawn, because it's disrespectful. And this wedding's turning into a disaster. Yeah, it is. 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 I don't think Seema has any idea how hard things are for me. Please don't get upset, because I'm actually more upset that you're going to leave. You're not leaving. No, don't cry. It's done. Listen, we're having fun. Babe, babe, please. Lauren, don't cry. You've done something wrong. It's really simple. Just say sorry and we can move on. Me? I have. What the hell's going on now? I heard what you said, Seema. What did I say? I'm not even getting into that. I just want to go home. I just want to go home. I'm actually devastated that you're leaving. I really don't even know where that's come from. I I'm hurt. I am really, really hurt. I've tried to make this day special for each and every single one of those girls, and they've done nothing but disrespect me. Now, Seema, do you feel it ruined the whole trip for you or no? No, look, I'm not going to go that far that it ruined the whole trip because we, we had a great time. It just ruined what was my special day. And you really mean that? It did ruin it? Yeah, I felt really, really hurt. Really? OK, wow. I'm going to have to tell you something. I put a face on because, actually, I love you. I came to the yeah, wedding... I knew that. To, no, no, well, now, actually, I'm going to have to say my say. You've had your say. Everyone knows I'd just finished court. The day I got on the plane, first thing I said to my girl is, is I need to just have... Fun. I hid under the piano. Was it a bit immature? Of course it was. I didn't want the flowers. And it was literally, I didn't think, I went, I don't want the bastard flowers, and I flung them. Of course that's wrong. And immediately, I apologised on the day. I said to you, I shouldn't have thrown the flowers. It was wrong. The way you spoke to me was like a child, and that's why I left your wedding, and that's why I'm upset with you. So it was Seema's tone in yeah. the way she spoke yeah. to you. So now you can bring yeah. it on. I don't, and say I don't really think it was my tone because if you actually see when I go outside, I'm actually saying, please don't go. No, but you did before um, that. Well, well why did fine. we both leave? I got the wrong end of the stick. I was, I, well, I, I was having a good time, and, and she came over and yeah. she said, Dawn, it's disrespectful, and I thought she meant I was. But then I started kicking off and said, I'm going. And obviously, looking back now, it's. I, I got the wrong end but of the stick. But I said sorry to you on the day. I was wrong for throwing yeah, you're flowers. Right. But you right. continued you're it, right. and that's where you're wrong. You're right. I didn't ruin your wedding. But that's fine. She didn't ruin it. It was a beautiful wedding. Had a fabulous time. I was just hurt that she wanted to leave. She, she just went to a lot of effort. It's fine. And I think she was just I left sad. because you spoke to me horrible. Oh, yeah, but you oh, don't speak horrible say. to anybody ever. But we have to tolerate it. You don't have to tolerate anything. You don't have to tolerate me. You don't have to hang around with me. Honestly, Seema, I said sorry on the day. It's this fine. is fine. Why are you fine? Because so you know why I'm aggressive. Because you don't know what I was going through. You know what, Brian? Oh, the simple fact it. is, it's you so can't win in this situation. You can win. You try and do something I good. I said sorry on the day. She said sorry. I'm wrong yet again. You know what? Voicemail, we're wrong. I should. I did a whole thing wrong. Flowers in a marriage. We're sorry. We forgive it. We forgive it like that. But then you hang on to it. Just flowers. Okay. Sorry. Exactly. In the grand scheme of things, just it probably is just flowers. But that was my special day. Awful divorce. And I just thought it was horrific. Let's see. Ma, kind of have the last word on it. It was your big day. It was my big day, but do you know what? It's totally fine. I don't want to upset them. And if it means I have to take that, I'll take it. It was me, not them. Don't come as a packet. Christine, I'd like to know what you think. Uh, you were a guest. It's just really unfortunate that it wasn't sorted out sooner and we couldn't just enjoy the rest of the night, you know, but that's, that's how it went. I hope they do sort it out.
I think they will. And can we all give it up for our amazing guest, Christine? Thank you.